Howdy guys, welcome back, Last of Us, part 1. We're up to part 14 now. Today's been a bit of a frustrating day. So I popped my old Elgato 60 HDS Plus. Yeah, I think that's what it's called. So, couldn't get that thing working, man. After about 90 minutes, everything was good. We had mic audio, but we just could not get any game audio going. I tried all the tutorials people recommended online. Elgato themselves recommended. We could get the audio through the headset, we could get it through the TV, we could get it through the speakers, the sub, but we just couldn't actually capture game audio. So I came to the consensus, heck, we're going to get the 4K60. That apparently records straight to an SD card. So we got ourselves one of those as well. It's all hopefully coming in the mail in the next week. So perhaps four to five parts from now, we should be recording in... The best possible quality that you can record PS5 games in. And yeah, we should be up there on par with you know, the best of the YouTube walkthrough community. Gameplay community, I should say. So for now, we got what we got. I feel like the PS5 internal capture card, it's a little lacking compared to the hardware you can obviously get. But it seems okay for now. I apologize if you're watching this video and... It's stuttering if it's having some sort of issues because I did jump in and have a look at some of the content I've put out and once I crank up the quality on YouTube to 4K, I seem to have some sort of stuttering issues and frame rate drops and then I compared it to other YouTubers and you know, that wasn't the case with their videos. So it wasn't the internet connection. I feel like it's definitely the recording software. It's a shame. I'm a little disappointed, but this is also a first PlayStation 5 walkthrough. You know, it's going to be a bit of trial and error until we get things going. Going to tinker with Audacity a little bit for, you know, my voice quality as well. Hopefully amplify that, make that a little better. You know, it's just constantly going to seek improvements and hopefully for the prologue part left behind when we get to that, you know, we're recording in as good a quality as you can get out of a PS5. So, apologies for taking up about 2 minutes 30 seconds of your time. Let's get into it. I just wanted to share that with y'all. Just let you know what's coming to the channel and the improvements we're seeking to get. Alright, let's get back into the story. Part 14. Ellie's become quite the hardened fighter after meeting Joel. I mean, she would have always been a tough kid, right? Remember the first time she got a flick knife out and stabbed one of those soldiers that was testing her for the infection? Yeah, she's never been a wimpy kid type, but she's definitely come a long way. Kind of reminds me of Tomb Raider, you know, the reboot for the PS4. How Lara Croft was this innocent explorer. And became a hardened killer at the end. He doesn't get to make that call. James told me it's the girl from the university. How many of our guys have been killed? Who's going to handle it? I just want to finish up and go for it. Freaking my ass off. So Ellie actually has no supplements she can take to boost anything. I think we uh, should craft a med kit though, just to have on hand for when we need it. And you know what? A nail bomb won't hurt either. Not us anyway. <clears throat> so if you've tuned in for a while now, I don't like to take things slow. Stealth is a good idea and it's fun for some, but... Oh, 
Whew. I swear she's got a smaller aim radical than Joel. You know, technically that makes Ellie a better shot than Joel. I feel like it was only yesterday we actually learned to shoot the rifle. When we were playing as Joel and she was covering us. So, there's probably a few of them still alive, but I feel like we took care of most. Stealth can be pretty fun, but I just find the gunplay in this pretty damn satisfying. The haptic feedback is a nice touch. Yeah, so her listening mode is definitely not as effective as Joel's. Oh. Did we blow this guy's arm off with that rifle? You know what? I think that's all of them. Oh. Took a chunk out of his face as well. Let's have a quick look here. So it doesn't seem like we're going to run into any infected. Yeah, can you imagine going through all this as a 14 year old? I sure as heck can't. I was a young shy kid. Getting an adrenaline dump and shaking so much as doing a one minute speech for English. Uh, here we got Ellie uh, taking on a whole gang of armed men. Yeah, who are trying to kill her to put things into perspective in a hostile environment. And we're sniping them from a football field away. With an old hunting rifle with no scope. So I also don't know if I mentioned this. We turn the film grain, grain off. Film grain off. There's a little tip I found on IGN when they were reviewing this game. Said it makes the visuals look a little better without the grainy effect. And yeah, we'll see how it turns out. Now, I'm really excited yet nervous for the 4K60 Elgato capture card as well. It looks very plug and play. You just connect it up to your monitor, your TV, the capture card and the PlayStation and it records straight to the SD. You don't even need to hook it up to the computer and I'm just thinking, okay, if it's going to be that simple, boom, plug and play, get the SD card out, chuck it into the uh, laptop And hopefully, we're going to have no more issues of gameplay audio. Okay, so what? We're going back. 
But yeah, I'm nervous if I run into a problem capturing gameplay audio with that, because, you know, the damn thing isn't cheap. And I really don't want to be contacting customer support and, you know, scratching my head and spending another 90 minutes, two hours trying to figure it out, especially if it's to no avail like it was today with the HD 60S Plus. Alright, so I think we're going to let him get a little bit closer and we'll just start popping him off. I think the first time I played this, I just sneaked around. But yeah, now I'm really looking for a fight. I want the confrontation, I want to do some shooting. So I want to see how good the uh, flanking is going to be with the improved AI. Ooh, he had his chance. Got quite a few shot off, shots off on us. No, we've taken no damage so far. Yeah, that might be all of them. Can't retrieve too many arrows back. I don't want to get cocky, but yeah, you know, this feels too easy. Okay. I don't really know what I'm doing with this dumpster. <laughs> okay. Oh, never mind. Moving it out of the way, not trying to climb it. Uh, I don't want to get trapped in here. Okay, let's push on. Well, I can use the door, but... Keep an eye on them for a sec. It's 
doesn't look like they have a way in. What? Okay, so we're really backing ourselves into a bit of a corner here. That's pretty brazen, just going on a head-on charge, even if it's a kid. They got a gun, multiple guns. Don't know what you'd be thinking. So there was only two of them, the ones that flanked around. Alright, well, quite a lot of crafting materials, but we got no use for anything. And I think we know by now I'm not a big fan of smoke bombs. Whoop. Alright, never mind. some time. What is it? It's deer. Is some human helping on the side? No. No, I, I promise. It's just the deer meat. You're a fucking animal. <laughs> Awfully quick to judgment. Considering you and your friend killed how many men? They didn't give us a choice. And you think we have a choice? Is that it? You kill to survive. And so do we. We have to take care of our own. By any means necessary. So now what? You gonna chop me up into tiny pieces? <laughs> I'd rather not. Please tell me your name. You're so full of shit. On the contrary, I've been, uh, been quite honest with you. Now I think it's your turn. 
It's the only way I'm going to be able to convince the others. Convince them of what? That you can come around. You have heart. You're loyal. And you're special. Oh. What am I supposed to tell the others now? Ellie. What? Tell them that... Ellie is the little girl. You broke your fucking finger! How did you put it? Hmm. Tiny pieces. See you in the morning, Ellie. Okay, so Joel's got his own bow. Yeah, I thought a lot of that gear was with Ellie. Yeah, I did know she had her own pistol. Looks like a Makarov. I wonder how long Joel's been out. I mean, if it's weeks, or even at least a week, well, should come to no surprise that she's going out. She got your medicine, stitched you up, dragged you here. I think that's to go out, but let's just have a quick look in here. Yeah, I'd personally wait for her to come back. Wait at least another couple of hours. Again, yeah, if that was me, where are you going to go look? And what are you hoping to find? Maybe she actually did just go out hunting, didn't run into any problems, and she's coming back. And it's better than both of you being out there. Just noticed our health's a bit low with Joel. It never ceases to amaze how they just come charging at you with absolutely no weapons. Okay. Yes, I got quite a bad skill level with Joel using the bow. Yeah, 
Now, it's pretty cool how, yeah, you take one of them out and yeah, it makes the others really start moving. They don't just stay behind the same cover. One way or another, you gotta tell me! Yeah, there's definitely a guy down there. Yeah, we'll keep the shotgun. I wonder if that was going to explode if I shot it. Okay, I thought they bailed. So there's at least two. Oh, we definitely tagged him. Oh, that's a bullseye. <laughs> Find ourselves a little workbench. Mm, maybe not. I warned you. I'm infected! I'm infected! Really? So are you. 
Right there. Roll up my sleeve. Look at it! I'll play along. <laughs> What'd you say? Everything happens for a reason, right? What the hell is that? She would have turned by now. It can't be real. Looks pretty fucking real to me. Okay, I think we're going to wrap it up right there. Wow. Well, Joel's up and about. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Hope to see you in the next video. Like I said, I'm really looking forward to putting out better quality content when this new PVR arrives. If you enjoyed, if you got this far, that means a lot to me. If you liked, commented, subscribed... Uh, it comes a long way too for a new channel like mine. Alright guys, we'll see you in the next one. Peace out.